This tutorial is going to be a bit different from all the others. This is a tutorial about loading configs as you enter a server. So as I join uh, Cubecraft, there you go, loaded in. You will see on the left hand side it says Cubecraft config loaded and it automatically displays my friends list um, as I join. And if I press my macro activate key, I have a completely different me menu than if I was to say disconnect here, join my single player world and have the tutorial config loaded and say hello people with my tutorial configuration and a different screen as I join this world. And this is what this episode is going to be about. So yeah, I uh, hope you all enjoy. Alright, another little follow-up tutorial on the last one where you are binding GUIs to make different pages of GUIs. Uh, this time I'm going to be making it so when you change config, all the different screens change. So the way we're going to do this is bind a script to th the onconfig change event up here. So over here we want to make a script such as this, dollar uh, dollar curly brackets, curly bracket dollar dollar, and in between you want to put dollar dollar, and then in between sh shovens or or like this, you want to put in your file.txt as written above, and in here I'm going to name this one quite simply on config change and then the name of tutorial. There we go. So I know that it's the on config change event for the tutorial config. All right. So I'm going to save that in there, just going to, there you go, control copy, save. And so now I'm going to make the script itself in here in the new file on, right click, control, oh dang it, on config change to tutorial. I will create that, it will automatically create a new thing. Okay, for the, in this case it's opened up this the specific one. So I'm going to put this here and it will automatically put these um, bind GUIs in place. So bind GUI in chat and then you put the um, screen that you want to see when you're in chat, in game, in debug and playback. So up to now I've just been using the playback screen. I'm not a fan of using the in game or in chat screens, um, especially not the in debug screen. But uh, to each their own, and I'm going to save that. And now when I head back over to the tutorial config, it should say tutorial, it should say tutorial config is loaded, and I have my tutorial config back in place with the switching pages and the name of the screen switching on the bottom left hand side. But yes, um, but yeah, this is back to your own config. And as a bonus, you can go in your text editor and go over here and, uh, for example, say echo hello people, save. So when you enter with the tutorial config for the first time, let's just head over to here and go head over to this one. It will say in chat, hello people. If I go in my key bindings in the configs, you can also set it so that you put it as the server's IP and every time that you join the server on that IP, the config will automatically switch to that, um, that server's config automatically. So you don't actually have to do anything, rebind any screens or anything like that. You can have different screens for different servers, different scripts for different servers, different chats for different servers, different events for different servers, etc. You get the idea. And yeah, I hope this was useful for you guys and thanks for watching.